Okay, so before we move down the arm and hit that whole nightmare that is the forearm, uh, I want to just finish this up. I promised that I would tell you about this muscle that is filling up this area through there, and that's the caracobrachialis. So I'm going to make it out of my brachialis, and then I'm going to hide our other muscles so we can just look at that. So caraco, meaning coming from the coracoid process, brachialis, meaning going to the arm, right? Anything, any muscle will, with, the world, with the word brachy in it, like brachioradialis, biceps brachii, which is the full name of the biceps through there, or in this case, caracobrachialis, is going to the humerus, right? When we talk about the arm and anatomy, we actually mean the, the humerus through there. So um, this muscle, caracobrachialis, is actually finishing more or less where the brachialis, which is that flat muscle between underneath the biceps, that's starting more or less here, and caracobrachialis is finishing more or less there. So, in, hang on, I'm struggling to grab hold of my caracobrachialis. Okay, through here, originating there in the coracoid process, coming down to the arm bone through there, pulls that to that, it's pulling the arm in towards the body. But when the arm is in towards the body, you're not going to see the inside of the arm. So you'll most likely see this arm when it's getting pulled out straight, right? When the arm rotates around like that, boom, that is also going to rotate out with the arm. And then you will often see that triangular shape on the inside of the arm. So you can certainly see it, but you would see it if someone was in like, like let's say a crucifix sort of position. You have to be fairly thin to be able to see it because um, you know, this, this the tops of the arms and towards the back, like I mentioned before, is where we store fat. So it's fairly likely that it might be softened by fat, but it's also fairly likely that you'll be able to see it. It's not one of those muscles that you can only see in, you know, super defined, super muscular people. So uh, with that, let's put back on our other muscles. That is all of the muscles of the, uh, of the upper arm. So next video, we'll start to work the muscles of the lower arm.